All right. So how is everyone's week going? Um, so I was trying to put out a a review yesterday, but I had some things going on, health-wise going on. And, um, you know, so it didn't happen, uh, which is very disappointing. Um, but... On with the review. So this movie has a story to it where about three or four or five years ago. um, So there's this channel named Echo something and now they're uh, um, Echo Nation. I don't know. They are... um, a reaction channel, and I came across them. I think they're um, Struggle Nation now. Um, but they had uh, a whole bunch of uh, reactions to short films, because that's the kind of thing they do along with other reactions. So it's mostly horror films they do. But um, So one of the, the films that they did was a film that was a short film for this movie and the per much of it is the short film of it is is uh, a world with powers and these in this guy comes to a structure uh structure work site and then he leaves and then cops come that apparently do not like his powers because they're not supposed to use their powers and he does this whole electric wave thing kills the co- robot cops and then then I noticed that on that, they had a link to a fundraiser that they're doing. Not fundraiser, but a, a GoFundMe for the making this movie. And then I looked into more of it, and apparently the the actor that's in here um, in that short film, which is also the directing this, is the uh, uh, something Admiral. He is the cousin of the guy who plays... Uh, the Green Arrow. And the Green Arrow actor was in here, too. Uh, he had a good role. Uh, they've been promoting this movie for a while and been working on it. Uh, this came out last year. They even put out a short part of the film to the, go back to the GoFundMe and people to uh, where, uh, be aware of it even more. Um. So I actually took me a little while to get around to doing watching this, and I'm kind of kicking myself in the butt for this. Um, it's something I've been wanting to watch, um, been waiting for, and um, the Asian actor in here was also in that short film. Now they obviously changed it up a little of that scene. Of uh, the short film, and then they the part in there that they did show for the second promotion of this channel. I mean, not channel, but um, this movie uh, definitely was pretty close to. Well, actually, it was actually legit part of the movie. Um, you can go look at these up and uh, see if you want to see this movie. If you have not heard of it, some a lot of people have not heard of this movie. Um. Hold on. Definitely a a good movie. Um, it is a low budget film with kind of high budget CGI and acting in it. Um, it it's between kind of uh, futuristic, but not really kind of between iRobot and uh, Chappie. Uh, you get kind of a, a chappy feel into this. Uh, a world where powers, people with powers are looked down upon, which is kind of like X-Men, but, you know, it's not really, it's more of uh, more of uh, realistic to this world of uh, drug trafficking and, um, you know, drug world. And it kind of has a little bit of a political in it. What I could get from it is kind of represents the the immigrants that come to this, chan- uh, this country in America and others, how they're looked down upon. You know, um, 
I got a little of that in there, and it didn't, like, overpower or anything. I thought it added to the story. And it was a good story. It was good acting, and I highly recommend it. There's not much else I can say without spoilers. Um, but, yeah, I give this five out of five stars. It is a great movie. It's refreshing from what we normally get. And, um, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. Um, if you have not heard of it, uh, you should go, uh, you should uh, rent it or whenever it comes out. I don't know if it's out on DVD or not. Or I don't see it on Netflix or anything. It could be. I just I didn't look that well. Um, but anyways, yeah. So please like the video. And if you have not already, please subscribe. And uh, I will have more videos out on Monday, hopefully. And um, yeah, have a good day, everyone.